order to win against a totalitarian regime, one must have technological superiority over the enemy. A leader is about someone who has to lift up the team. A leader lead is someone who needs to absorb the pressure when they have doubts. We are seeing challenges that are complex, they are interconnected, they are and they are escalating at an alarming pace. Today, the leaders, I talk about the four C's of leadership. Courage, confidence, communication, and conviction. I, I believe that the most important thing is to have a clear objective, because once you know where you want to go, uh, you can figure out how to get there. And that requires what I believe is the most important thing of leadership, which is to prioritize. Well, what's required of leaders is vision, drive, charisma, an ability to galvanize people for a common cause. A leadership should know how to communicate to its people. The message that should be sent uh, to the masses should be clear. These times of conflict being so driven by exponential technologies, leaders need to wrap their heads around these technologies. To accept and to address the situation as it is, not as you want it to be or as it was in the past. They have to put their head above the parapet and they have to lead by example. But they also have to get the narrative right because I think what we're learning at the moment is that populations and voters don't want to get their mind around the problem. We must be clear and focusing to have solutions for the problems of our uh, communities. First is that we must embrace peace. Must not engage in speaking in a way that will escalate it, but must engage in comprehensive dialogue.